Typhoon Shanshan strikes Japan. Severe impact on Kyushu and other areas. On Friday, Typhoon Shanshan brought heavy rains to a wide swath of Japan, prompting warnings of flooding and landslides even hundreds of kilometers away. The typhoon brought many transportation systems to a standstill and temporarily halted production at major factories. In the Kyushu region, residents of Fukuoka City hid from the storm as a typhoon of historic strength that made landfall in the region rage through the area, leaving the city with quiet streets and closed storefronts. At the entrance to a deserted, rain-drenched shopping mall near a train station in Fukuoka City, university student Shin Hasegawa, 21, was trying to get home but was facing difficulties. The trains aren't running at all because of the typhoon, he said, so my parents had to pick me up. We stayed at a friend's house and then came here, but we thought the trains were running, but they weren't at all, she said. It's the first time I've ever seen all the trains stop. At least three people have been reported killed and 78 injured in the past few days, according to the Disaster Management Agency. The typhoon, with winds of 180 kilometers per hour, 112 miles per hour, and enough force to knock down even a moving truck, was located near Kunitachi City in Oida Prefecture late Thursday night and was moving northeastward. About 125,000 households in seven prefectures in Kyushu were without power and work is underway to restore power, according to Kyushu Electric Power Co.
However, due to the warm and humid air around the typhoon, heavy rain continues to fall even in areas far from the typhoon's main body, and there are concerns that the typhoon is moving slower than expected. Across Japan, especially in Kyushu, and in many areas including Tokyo and Yokohama, calls for evacuation preparations have been issued for more than 4 million people. The city of Yokohama has been warned of an increased risk of landslides. But as of Thursday, only about 30,000 people, mostly in Kyushu, had evacuated, said Yoshifumi Matsumura, minister in charge of disaster management. After leaving Kyushu, the typhoon is expected to approach central and eastern regions, including Tokyo, over the weekend. Automaker Toyota temporarily suspended operations at all its plants in Japan due to the typhoon, while Nissan, Honda, semiconductor companies Renesas and Tokyo Electron, and electronics giant Sony also suspended production at some of their plants. Airlines, including Anna Holdings and Japan Airlines, canceled hundreds of domestic and international flights, many ferries and rail services were also suspended, and the Shinkansen bullet train service between Tokyo and Nagoya was suspended Friday morning. Lin Yuhua 60, a tourist from Taiwan, had her return flight from Fukuoka to Taiwan canceled on Thursday. She was told to book another flight, but did not know when she would be able to return home. I was very worried and anxious, she said. I didn't know what to do, she said. I stayed in Japan for one more day. Then we heard on the news that our flight had flown over Japan for about 40 minutes and then turned back to Taiwan. Then we were busy trying to find a way back home. Typhoon Shanshan is the latest severe weather system to hit Japan following Typhoon Ampel, which caused power outages and evacuations earlier this month. 